But one of the things that struck me about my experience in the Armed Forces Parliamentary Scheme is that there is no standard military job. The diversity of experiences and skills and the diversity of people was striking. Would my honourable friend give way on that very point? Yes, I will give way. Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. I am very grateful to my honourable friend for, raising, for um, arranging today's debate, and I commend what she is saying. Um, in my constituency, there are many retired Gurkha soldiers those who retired before 1997 unfortunately receive a much lower pension than other colleagues in the British Army. Does she agree with me that it is very important for ministers now to listen to the issues being raised by the Gurkhas? And would she also agree with me that it is absolutely incumbent on ministers to continue the discussions with the Nepalese government and to bring that to a fruitful conclusion? I thank my honourable friend for his contribution. And yes, you. He is, he is right that that conversation around pensions and with the Nepalese government um, is, you know, is continued and that he will have an audience, you know, he will speak to the, the, the Minister about this and the Secretary of State.